Welcome to another stretch and flow which works on the entire body. Sit in a comfortable cross leg position with your palms facing up. Take a few deep breaths. Inhale and exhale. Watch your breath. Take deep breaths. Now gently drop your head towards your right shoulder and push down slowly with your right hand. Hold the stretch as you keep inhaling and exhaling. Now bring your head back to neutral position and drop your head to the left side towards your left shoulder and again gently pulling down with your left hand. If you suffer from spondylitis, please do not push yourself do only what is comfortable for you. Now bring your head back to neutral position. Bring your right hand and place it on your left knee and place your left hand behind you and gaze backwards. This is a good twist for the spine. Gently release. Now bring your left hand and place it on your right knee and place your right hand behind you and gaze behind. Keep breathing normally. Gently release. Now come on to all fours into a tabletop position with your knees positioned below your hips and your hands positioned below your shoulders. Now we will do a cat and cow. As you inhale, drop your belly down and look up. As you exhale, bring your belly up and bring your chin towards your chest. Again inhale, drop your belly down, look up. Exhale, bring your belly up and chin towards your chest. Repeat one more time. Inhale. Drop your belly down and exhale, round your belly up and bring your chin towards your chest. Now from this tabletop position, extend your right arm towards the sky and slowly thread your right arm behind your left hand and bring your shoulder, your cheek and your ear to touch the floor. Take your left hand behind your back. Keep breathing normally. Gently release, bring your left hand back to the floor, support yourself and again take your right arm up towards the sky and extend it. Bring your right hand back to the floor, extend your right leg behind you and cross it over to the left side and bring your gaze over your left shoulder to look at your right foot. Bring your right leg back and come back to the tabletop position. Now extend your left arm towards the sky and thread your left arm behind your right hand and bring your shoulder and cheek to touch the floor. Bring your right hand behind your back. Keep breathing normally, never hold your breath. Now slowly bring your right hand back onto the mat and with the help of your right hand Bring yourself up and extend your left hand up again towards the sky and slowly bring it back onto the mat. Now extend your left leg straight behind you and cross it over onto your right side. Look over your shoulder. Now bring your left leg back to the tabletop and from there come to the downward facing dog. Paddle your feet. If your heels are not able to touch the floor, it's okay. Bend your knees. Now 
now bring your right foot and place it next to your right hand and open out your chest and stay in the stretch this will act on your hips and your quadriceps now lift your left knee off the mat and take your right hand up towards the sky into a gentle twist look up at your hand if possible now bring your right hand back down and place your left knee on the floor and come back to a downward dog now bring your left foot and place it next to your left hand your knee touching the floor right knee touching the floor and open out your chest shoulders relaxed and stay in this position keep breathing normally now bring your right knee off the mat and left knee up left hand up towards the sky and look up towards your left hand slowly bring your left hand back towards the mat and come to a downward dog position keep breathing in the down dog now take your right leg up into the sky bend your leg at the knee and open out your hips and drop your right foot next to your right hand slowly bend your left leg at the knee and with the help of your right hand pull it towards your body this is a good twist and at the same time works your uh, quads and your hips slowly release your foot and come back to the downward dog position now from the downward dog position bring your left leg up into the air bend your left leg at the knee and open out your hips as much as you can now drop your left foot next to your left hand slowly bend your right leg at the knee and with the help of your left hand hold on to your right foot and stretch take your gaze behind you breathing normally slowly release your left foot and place your hands back on the mat and come to a downward dog keep breathing in the down dog position bring your knees back onto the mat and open out your knees a little wider and bring your hips to sit on your ankles and come into a child's pose this is a modified child's pose keep breathing normally with the help of your hands come out of this pose and swing your legs behind you and sit in vajrasana we are sitting on your heels place your left hand on your right knee and your right hand behind you and take your gaze backwards keep breathing slowly release now bring your right hand onto your left knee and your left hand behind you and take your gaze also behind you breathe normally gently release Now swing your legs in front of you and sit in a comfortable cross leg position with your palms facing up. Close your eyes and focus on all the parts of your body, all the muscles that are now relaxed. 
keep breathing normally take a deep inhalation and deep exhalation Now join your hands in front of your chest and pay gratitude for your practice today.